have more on today's um, con drill versus count drill. This is about 20 minutes later. Now you'll note how the plane seems to go invisible. It's a clone plane! No, no, no guys, it, it, it's called pixelated out on a cheap camera. At, on 200 digital zoom. That's, that's why it disappears. Okay, I just thought I'd throw that in. I, I realize most of the people that were posting all kinds of shit as chemtrails were actually just, you know, some of that original 28,000 people that were hired. Way back in 2010. Oh, there it is. <sighs> to uh, shill out the, the uh, internet and do whatever, attack whatever they were told. There. There's the same little guy yet. It's not gonna focus, it's too late, too dark. Anyhow, the point was, uh, when it's pixelated, it, parts of it get invisible because the camera's just guessing on the detail. Like, get fucking real. Why the fuck would, uh, would the plane look like a plane from a distance, squinting, squinting, and then when you get up real close, it, it disappears because, because the action of looking at it at greater magnification, what, uh, affects the stealth, the cloaking? Like, get fucking real. Can't you give these pathetic fucking loser paid shills at least a plausible fucking script? Because you know what's going to happen. You make them all look like dumb fucking bastards and then you leave them out to hang. Not even like brown shirts. Because they're just contractors, no, afforded no protection at all. They're their own entity acting on their own accord for whatever peanuts you paid them. What do you think they're gonna do to you if uh, they, if you don't succeed in having them strung up from the lamppost and taking the blame for your actions? You've deranged them, you've dishonored them. You've tempted them with fucking peanuts and made them the laughing stock for years on the internet by making them say these totally lame, implausible fucking nonsense. <laughs> what do you think they're gonna do to you? Because they're no longer like high school kids that you tried to take their kids away and give them an option B. Well, no, here, you can raise your welfare brat, and here, do this. Yes, never mind taking your clothes off and inserting objects into your body on uh, fake cyber dating things for credit card scams. Here, do this. You'll be a patriot serving your country as a brown-shirted contractor fucking up legitimate, uh, worthy internet communications brilliant just all deserve each other well I hope you've enjoyed this issue of con trail Even if the sights weren't so spectacular. Maybe we can get this to pick the light out if I can just hold it still long enough. Okay, yes. Let's make that point. I'll put a real effort here. I'll sit down, hopefully not on the cactuses. Cactuses. If I wasn't lying, 
a boat, you never, <coughs> you never go pantless. Desert girls don't even wear dresses just because of that. Okay. Yeah. There's that transmitter tower for the aircraft. I presume it's UHF. There's no sun on it, so the the re reflectivity is relatively stable, so it's probably not going to disappear. Now well, we tried. But you can do the same experiment on things at distance with your cheap cameras too. When the uh, light conditions are bright enough to go over the maximum of the camera, that's when you'll really, especially if you're shooting from a place of shade, <clears throat> you'll trip up the centers, and that's where, well, there's just no log of the rhythm to fill in the blanks when you're pixelated out like that. And that's why it seems that the wings disappear on the, the alien ship that's cloaked to look like a chemtrail spraying aircraft. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. A real lot, I'm sure. <clears throat> they went to all the bother of fucking cloaking their UFO to let you see a chem trail spraying aircraft from, say, Evergreen Air. Really, I would just rat whoever my handler was, I would just rat them out right away in a lawful manner. Because, you know, you can't, like, rat out a CIA spy or whatever, because um, they drew up laws about that. Well, you can, but you got to be careful about doing it. You have to be overriding a hokey, non-existent fake law for a real law that basically the common sense gist of it is you're... you're Serving public safety that couldn't be served in any other way And to violate some minor statute or policy All right, there we go None of that constitutes legal Direct legal advice to anyone about any particular subject obviously I am NOT a barrister Nor have you retained me Nor am I acting as your pro se just saying. Seek legal advice before you try and bail your ass out. Or they'll really own you. That's just how these clods do it. Like the child kidnapping thing. We'll, uh, we'll get your, your kid back, but uh, we're going to come and ask a thing of you, you know? That's how they do it. Or, or whatever. Yeah, we can make uh, we can make these uh, drug charges go away, but uh, well, we're gonna ask you to do a thing. And they come back with what seems like a lesser thing, but is really high treason, like like the brown shirts, contracted paid internet shills. Well, as you can see, let's bring some making its way, but it's been chilling off at night as it does in the mountains. So it kind of takes a while for things to get melting again. Toodaloo!